Hello everybody, me Sam's Walk Trains and More here back with another bonus more video and I'm going to be showing you what I got in the Wilco closing down sale because Wilco has now officially closed, my local store has closed today. So first of all, we're going to take you back to past Sam who showed you a few clips earlier in the Wilco store. Could have done with a new tea time, this one's 52p. What a bargain, I'll take that. And you come down here to where I want the garden and the season wire is. It's just the saddest sight you've ever seen in your life. There's literally nothing down there. Nothing. They've just got like random bits in, to be honest with you. Like tea towels and a glass cough, which I wish I could do cleaning my window with. Other than that, nothing. They're literally reducing everything really right down. They've even blocked off half the shop now, to be honest with you. Out of the kitchen section before previously the front section still got a few bits in it's the last day today the store closes for the staff tomorrow but the last day for customers today boxes everywhere they've got, they've got, they've got, they've got nothing in here just empty boxes everywhere yeah nothing in here that's what the former pick and mix section which is completely empty They've just got random bits like cards. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and what on earth is that? A dust bath. They've just got random stuff. But it's sad to see Wilco close for the final time. Hiding down the back of the shop where it's quiet so no one can see me walking. As mentioned, picked up some details. But spoilers, they've actually been here since August when they announced it was closing down. And I've actually got some bits at home which I've not shown you guys. But I'm actually going to do your proper haul of the uh, bargains I got in the uh, Wilco closing down sale when I get home. But it's sad. It's the last day of the rugby store today, my local store. Some other stores are going to be open until the start of October. But when they're closing for good, I do feel sorry for all the staff that are losing their jobs here in Wilco. It's very, very sad to see it go. Wine glasses that originally £40 gone down to £8. Gosh. So they've, so they've just announced that everything in the store is now 90% off. So I picked up two of these Wi-Fi cables which actually connect our router to the um, thing of the wall because we've had problems with the past where one of the cats has chewed the wire so I thought I'd stock up and get two since they're now less than a pound and back in the day I would have paid a fiver for these right two flannels a glass cloth two uh, like internet leads in a, a wheelchair bag £2.50 So not only have I got stuff today, I've actually been in there the past couple of weeks and got uh, stuff So it, it has like, altered like, the prices over the past few weeks like, I think at first it went from like 30 to 50 to 80 and then as I was leaving 90% off for a few bits I got today So we're going to start off with uh, Actually, I won't do it in any particular order We'll just start off with, I'll just grab, grab rounds and things out of the bag. So start off, we've, we've got some like Andrex toilet wipes. And I believe, I'm not sure what the prices were, but I think these were less than a, I think these were about, um, I think these were only 30% off at the time. So I think these were just less than a pound. But compared to some shops that sell them for like 150, I thought that was still a good price. But yeah, I wasn't over happy with the price of them one. To be honest with you, I wish they were a little bit cheaper, but that's just me being petty. One thing I did get for a bag, and I thought this is like, it's like multi-purpose, like, tape. And I thought this was good because it's uh, waterproof for indoor and outdoor use, this tape is. And also, uh, it's tough yet, and it's is easy to tear. And, I thought, um, it, and it says suitable for fixing, sealing, and binding. And I thought as well that this would be handy for, um, like, hanging stuff up on the wall. And also, not just that, as you guys know, at Christmas, I do a Christmas light display and there are some things which dangle. And I'm hoping that I might be able to tape them nicely with this tape. So that's what I got this for. So that is actually quite a handy uh, buy. And I believe this was reduced. This was initially almost six quid for this. And I got this for half the price. So three some. 370 I think that was or 350 so not too bad considering that was like almost six quid before 
Now this, I don't think my sister's sister's gonna watch this video, but if she does, then my, never mind. But I got a joke present for a car. I got some dash dash uh, board wipes. I believe these were reduced down to less than 50p. I believe for these ones, that was quite cheap. And then, I'm not going to show you the front of it, but um, I'll show you the uh, the back of it. I'm just trying to find the other envelope. Ah, uh, the envelope's there. But I'm just going to actually. Uh, I got some cards, some birthday cards for my brother whose birthday is in December and also for my sisters who's in February because I because I thought this was a bargain if, because initially these were a pound but I believe these were actually down to about 30p when I got them and today, annoyingly, they're even down to 10p they were for cards in my local Wilco. I'm going to save something to last because I got myself the ultimate bargain I did. So first of all, we're going to go to the stuff I got today. Because I've got this. Oh, I tell a lie. Also, I've not got these in this, this bag. But I also purchased some coat hangers at the start of the sale. Um, and they were down to uh, about £1 something for about 10 coat hangers. They're in my wardrobe. I forgot to mention. I forgot to put these ones in the hall. But to be honest with you, they're too big for the bag. So I just put them straight in my wardrobe. Now we're going to go to stuff that I bought today and I've got uh, two internet cables for our internet box. I think we've already got a spare one of these in the cupboard anyway, but these are handy because it connects the inter the back of the internet box to the um, the little port in the uh, wall. And these initially, this was one of the big bargains, these initially should have been £5 each. These were about 75p today in the closing down sale. So, hashtag Sam likes a bargain. Now, my mum says this is actually a tea towel, but on the shelf, this was described as like a. Yeah, it was, it was described as a glass cloth and a fork. My windows are really filthy, so I'm going to give them a clean with this uh, cloth and also some um, glass cleaning wipes. So, that was a. Uh, about 25p for that one. Now the tea towels were initially, I got one and these were gone down to 52p and I thought, hmm, that's a good price, but it could do them being a bit cheaper. Then the announcement came on to say that everything was 90% off. So this was about about 30 to 40p. This was a this was a bargain because we actually need a new tea towel in this house actually. I don't know what happened to all the other ones. And then I, I go through flannels like nobody's business and these were down to about 25p too. So these were an absolute bargain. So I've got two of them. And now going back a couple of weeks, I got the biggest bargain of the uh, century. And this was, and I forget the price of these now, I think these were actually initially £10 something. And what they are, they're multicoloured outdoor Christmas lights. And I'm hoping, fingers crossed, they work. They do. Because this will be handy in my Christmas display, which I'll probably start at the back end of November. So stay tuned for that vlog. And these were initially, I think that these, these were about £10 something. I got these for the discounted price of, I believe these were about £4. And I thought... For Christmas lights, bearing in mind you get a hundred, I thought that was a good price. So that and the internet cables were my biggest uh, nice uh, discounted uh, items. So that is what I got in the Wilco closing down sale. They just basically had random bits to be honest with you. But it is sad to see Wil Wilco go. So farewell to Wilco. I do hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed it. And uh, if you want to become a member of the channel, you can do. There's some more exclusive perks down there. And uh, as I mentioned, like the video, comment down below some feedback would be appreciated as well. And uh, subscribe if you're new, because we're trying to get to 2,000 subscribers. We're getting ever so close now. We've only got just over 100 to go now. But we've got about 160 more to get to 2,000. So it's free to subscribe. 
and have the bell on for all notifications so you don't miss any future videos or live streams. We do normally do train videos on this channel, railway vlogs, but because Wilco was a childhood shop of mine, I thought I'd go pay it a visit for the final time. Right, bye everybody, peace out. I heard a song So shallow and poor I almost sang along